What do you mean? I literally am just like. Get too bad, man. Get too bad, man. Get too bad, man. And a tower from the enemy. Get too bad, man. Get too bad, man. Get too bad, man. Kiss the cross and touch the sky. All bad mind things must stop. We are born of bad mind. We, we are born of bad mind. It's too bad. It's too bad. Oh, witty, 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 witty. Hey, rise and shine, sunrisers. Happy Monday, March. It's certainly marching on. We got left. We got six days left. Six days left in the month. So let's be reminded that every day is a gift. That's why they call it. The present. That's right. But That's actually one of my favorite plays on words that exist. You yes, know. that is also one of mine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's such a clever one. Yeah. English language is clever like that clever sometimes. Like that. Some, sometimes it just crazy. Fools. Sometimes it just fools. <laughs> ah. I've always wondered, speaking of English being so crazy, or mm -hmm. what's the plural of mouse? Mice. If you have more than one house, you have? Heist. Shouldn't it be? <laughs> and if you spill a bunch of rice grains, shouldn't you pick them? If you pick up one, you pick up a? a rouse. Correct. He's <laughs> such a smart guy. <laughs> That's what it should be. Just for continuity. I like, I like things that are consistent. Yeah, it, it, except that that's not how the language evolves. And so the, the evolution of the language the words have come from all over. Dennis, I don't even justify the foolishness. Yeah, it's, because... it's foolishness. <laughs> so it's just a case of the English language um, teeth things from all the places where the English went. <laughs> the irony. <laughs> Yeah. You know, just exactly. very much like other aspects of the culture. Exactly. Oh, man. But no, it's a great Monday morning. How was your yes. weekend? Ah, it was a good weekend. Mm -hmm. I would have loved for it to have been a bit more restful. Yeah. But when you have children you who are not... Hardware. Um, I see you're doing... Um, Look here. Construction. DIY. DIY. Hey. Yeah. D-I-E-N-D. <laughs> Up in here. Bobisha yeah. the Builder. Yeah. Hey, Dennis, it I work, you know? It may tile, you know? Mm -hmm. Mercy. I saw it and I was like, I thought I saw it and I thought to myself, no. No, yes. L like no. Like so me, actually, I'm not. I I'm finished not the like painting that. on Saturday. Okay. So uh -huh. I completed everything. So so you can okay. So the weekend that should have been restful mm -hmm. wasn't extremely restful because I was completing that project. Mm -hmm. And then fast forward to Sunday, one of my littles is not feeling so wonderful. Yes. So Juggling that with the other little is just a lot, but I kept walking down to the laundry area and admiring my work. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just like, oh, I did that. But yeah, that mm. was the weekend that was. How was okay. yours? It was a good weekend. Yeah. I mean, lots of little, little stuff, 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 stuff to do here mm -hmm. and there. But you know, when I like, you know, on a, on a, between a Friday evening and an early Saturday morning, I create a things to do list. Mm -hmm. And there's a sense of accomplishment that you get. When you, when you finish your yeah, list, man. like I, I put all the ticks beside it. Well done. You know, I think there's a, there's a there's a cognitive like huh. light bulb that goes off and they're like that. yeah, which is why I create the list. Yeah. Create lists. Here's the pro tip: create lists, and then tick the things off, and it gives you a feeling of accomplishment. No, it seriously does, mm -hmm. and not just um, short lists for to do. You know, for this day, or mm. I actually really believe in creating lists for mm -hmm. your year. Yeah, for yeah, yeah, your yeah. five-year goal, yeah, yeah, yeah. I really believe. I mean, mm -hmm. the Bible actually says it, you know, mm -hmm. write it out and make it plain. Yes, you have to yes, write yes. out your plan. So mm -hmm. I believe firmly mm -hmm. in that. Yeah. Firmly. And if time. you write it, it saves you from the need to tell everybody. Because mm. Lord knows sometimes we tell too many people our plan. Yeah. And it's not for everybody. Right, right. So yeah, yeah. Just write it down. Yeah. Yeah. And it also helps you to also get a bit of clarity and a sense of direction yeah. and know, even for just the weekend, as yeah, you say, yeah. you have a yeah, sense yeah. of what you need to get mm -hmm. done. And when you do it, you're just mm -hmm. like, yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'm that guy. It is. Yeah. It is. Can you it do is. me a favor, please? Sure. Can you pass me the stand right there? Sure. Okay. Yeah. I actually feel very, <laughs> feel <laughs> a little <laughs> mile west. You feel, you feel for a couple of, oh, a couple of mile. Would you like a cup as well? Oh, I could do one. Yeah, yeah, all right, I'll do one. Why that went so high pitch? Like you don't really want yeah, it. It's <laughs> but you don't I'm want a flat me. No, I'm a coffee person. Uh, but no, I, I, I do a little <laughs> coffee you know substitute. Way, <laughs> 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 
<laughs> That's so true. <laughs> Every time anybody gets too high pitched, I'm yeah. like bombastic mm. side. Yeah. yeah, that's true. But no, mm -hmm. um, generally speaking, um, I'm looking forward to what's coming up on this weekend. Mm -hmm. There's a quote that we have, International Women's Month quote. Sometimes mm. what you're looking for is already there. That's right. That's Aretha Franklin. Aretha Franklin said that. Sometimes what you're looking for is already there. It's just that you're not looking in the right place. No, it's true. You know, and so some of the times, you know, you have to think about it. But but that's so true though. Like some of the times like we <laughs> Hey, what's up, big here? Uh, we know we know what product has not been <laughs> the source of the bandit. <laughs> um we, you need a little bit of mm -mm. a little, little, little bit of elbow grease. There we what go. What we need yeah. is what we need is a knife. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah, just yeah. There the we knife go. And you say, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There we go. It happens sometimes with the horlicks too. Dennis, you yeah. like horlicks? I love I love Horlicks. This day in history, in 1965, civil rights activists led by Martin Luther King Jr. successfully completed their four-day, 50-mile or 80-kilometer march from Selma to the capital in Montgomery, Alabama. The march was to demonstrate the desire of African-American citizens to exercise their constitutional right to vote. And, of course, we know it was the subject of a movie called yeah, Selma. Yeah, Selma, mm-hmm. Um, so, um, yeah, that, was, that happened on this day. They completed their march to Selma. You know what's really crazy about this? Mm -hmm. These things will, will merely be history to our children, yes. but we are living in a time where our parents lived in that time. Mm -hmm. So you hear first-hand recollection of it, yeah. and it's um, it's not that far. No, not, it's not. it wasn't that long no, ago. No, 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 it wasn't, it wasn't. It's not as historic as yeah. many would like to believe. As the images yeah. appear, yeah. it's actually in recent times. If, it, if I was, what, like 15, 20 years old, I would have probably had a, yeah. an awareness of yeah. it. So it's, Our you parents know. lived that yeah. Yeah. and saw it firsthand mm -hmm. in their news coverage. In their news coverage, yeah. and it, you know. It was something that was important mm -hmm. to them. So I mean, yeah. Yeah. You know what else happened what on the weekend? What historic are we doing so that the next generation? I think about that all the time. Mm -hmm. That we are living in, what we are currently living will be history for someone. Yep. I think about it mm -hmm. all the time. Like things happening in the government, things yes. happening internationally. Like some history students is going to be talking about it and arguing about it. You know what it will yeah. be? Let me tell you what it will be. Yeah. The pandemic. Yes. We lived the pandemic, and mm -hmm. then there are going to be some, some it, in the future, mm -hmm. our mm -hmm. grandchildren will go, wow, you know, I always used to hear 50 them. years ago, <laughs> I read about this pandemic, <laughs> and we're going to be like, child, <laughs> let me tell you about those no, no movement days. But hold on, no, it's going to be a case of Isaiah's um, kids. Yes. Um, and, and, and I always used to hear Nana Yendi talk about it, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's same one. It's that's exactly yeah. what's gonna happen. Uh, trust yeah. me, trust me, sir. Um, my neighbor actually, I saw my neighbor come out to the playground yesterday, mm -hmm. and his hands were stained with red. Mm -hmm. His face was was stained with with red, and I said to him, I said, "Are you okay? What's wrong? What?" Why, why are you so red? And he went, I went to the Holy Festival. <laughs> That's what oh, happened yes. on the weekend I as saw, well. <laughs> I saw a couple of people's stories. Yes. I saw a couple of people's stories. Um, so it was Holly, which is a popular and significant Hindu festival, mm -hmm. celebrated as the Festival of Colors, yes. Love and Spring. It uh, celebrates the eternal and divine love of the deities uh, Radha, the dearest of Krishna's consorts, mm -hmm. and Krishna, the eighth avatar of Vishnu, Vishnu. Mm -hmm. and also as the supreme god in his own right, um, if you believe, or if you're inclined towards Hinduism. So, yeah. But, but this is literally Holy, where Holy. or out of many comes in. Yeah, yeah. Because there was a massive celebration that happened at Hope Gardens mm -hmm. yesterday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I, saw, I, saw, I did festival. see people on... And it's, it's a, I think it's such a beautiful thing that we can respect other cultures, mm -hmm. respect other um, religions, mm -hmm. and just mm -hmm, honor mm -hmm. what they do, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. So it's lovely that we could have that right here mm. in Jamaica. Yeah, man, definitely. And then the following weekend, it's going to be Easter. Yeah. And people will respect that as well. And this is how it ought to be. Indeed. Yeah. Indeed. Yeah. Man. It's also International Waffle Day. You like a waffle? I don't. You don't like waffles? <laughs> <laughs> really? Oh, 
Hey, okay. that sounds like too much Judge judgment. <laughs> Stop no. this. No, it's just pure surprise because you seem like the type. You like pancakes? They're not my first choice. Okay. You know what it is? I can't. To me, if I'm going to have flour, uh -huh. I just give me the dumpling. <laughs> <laughs> cool, <laughs> That's how I feel. Cool, you know cool, what I mean? Yeah. So but you don't like waffles and chicken and waffles and... I like waffles and shrimp and... I've never tried it. Yeah. Hey, slow down. I see you trying to like be a little I'm less like, judgmental. Yeah, no, no, I'm just thinking, you know, let's go and do waffles. But I have there. a girlfriend yeah. who absolutely loves waffles and fried chicken. Like, she loved that damn. Mm -hmm. But she went to university in Atlanta. Okay, so I think okay. that's very yeah, yeah, much yeah. that influence oh, for waffle her. Waffle house type of thing. Exactly. But is it good? Are you telling me yeah, I should yeah, yeah. try it? It, it, it? Yeah, we could do waffles. Waffles I mean, and shrimp? Or waffles. I, I, I like, there's, um, I, I go to Brood Awakenings mm -hmm. um, in Ligani, and I, I, I tend to order a shrimp omelet with waffles. You know what? You know I'm going to try. Yeah. You know because I'm going to try. Because the team at Brood, they, yeah. um, they always treat me well. By now, they, when I walk in, they, they know, know what you I'm order. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know you order. I'm never sure how to feel about that. It's like that for yeah. me at um, Tea Tree Crepery. Yeah. Sometimes I get inside and the guy said, I already put Smoke your order Marlin. in for you. <laughs> Smoke Marlin it's and crepe. I'm steak and eggs. Really? Mm-hmm. Oh. Yep. And that was, that was, my, that was my, one of my biggest pregnancy cravings. Mm. So he would put in my order. And I don't know if I'm just like, I don't know how to feel about that. Am I too predictable or what? I don't know. I like to mix like, it up. That was like me. No, I don't mind like now because the order sounds like nice. It's like, you know, when I walk into Wendy's and they say, large fries down. Because <laughs> I know it because it jacks every day. You know, when what? I walk into Burger King at lunchtime. Large fries down. <laughs> you know, it's, they know. Yeah. Oh my gosh. But um, but like when in, in when I was in high school and you walk into the shop and them say half a bread, <laughs> quarter bread, and you're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Trust me. It's cool, man. Right? <laughs> mm, I hear that. I hear that. But I love that we can do that. Yeah. yeah I actually love yeah. that you can buy two spl two slices or two spoon of milo. Yeah. I actually love that. Yeah, you yeah, have that yeah. ability. I do. Send me a wipe of bread. Yep. A wipe of butter. You know you don't have that? A wipe of butter? A squeeze of toothpaste. A squeeze of toothpaste. Hey. Yeah. Oh, one such is one such is out I did. Come on, hey. let me tell the people that I'm going to But right. you know more get a life. Hey. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, hey, guess who's are you ready? Piece. Are you ready? Guess who's guess whose birthday it is? I'm gonna guess. It is the queen herself, based on the track in the background. Queen Angelica <laughs> celebrates her birthday today. She is born Ventrice Morgan, ah. a reggae singer and disc jockey. You didn't know that? Mm -hmm. She has a disc jockey part? Yeah, man, yeah, yes, man. Yes, man, from yeah, the man. hills above Montego Bay, yeah. Jamaica. She is the daughter of ska musician Derek Morgan, but was raised by her mother and stepfather. And she's known for tackling some quite topical and like, yeah, controversial taboo issues sometimes. online. Yeah, yeah. but sometimes, some of the things they must have to talk yeah, sometimes, yeah, yeah. you know? You ever um, hear our leader, Naya Bingi? I have hey. not. Anthony, Anthony, I have Anthony, not heard her lead it, but I love a Naya Bingi session. Yeah, no man, her love. voice. Just leading an I having a session. Oh, I need to hear that. Nice, mm. man. Mm. Make you want to Rasta. Hey. <laughs> hey. I want to, you know, remember, say, them say you don't have to dread, you know. Rasta, ah, heart. Rasta yeah. is a liberty. Eyes is. Eyes. Uh -huh. yeah, we got yeah. a quote from her this morning. Yeah. And it's Aretha. her birthday. It would have been Aretha. Aretha's birthday. Yeah. Yeah. It mm. makes sense. Now that I think about it, she's such a fire sign. It makes sense. You ever see her in her interviews? Both of them. Both of them. Yeah, yeah. Both of them. When both she went, people just flop, like. you know, and yeah. you down. Yeah, man. But she was a proper diva from young, 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 mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. Born in, raised in the oh, church. When you get home. You know, and so, yeah. Oh, Queen of Soul. Rolling Stone twice named her as the greatest <laughs> singer of all time. One of my favorite clips with Aretha mm -hmm. <laughs> is where she's sitting on this coach and they're showing her different singers of this generation. Yeah. And they're saying, you know, what do you think of this singer? And she so they put up one singer and she goes, oh, yeah, great performer. They put up the next singer and she goes, yep, hits great notes. Put up the next singer and she goes, lovely dresses, great dresses. <laughs> Say she's shady, she you know. She wins. She shady. Win, she win. <laughs> shady. Uh, so yesterday yeah. was Palm Sunday, so you yes. know what that means. It means mm. it's time to make a joyful noise. All right, so all right. Run the chorus mix selector. Hallelujah. <laughs> 